Hi, I'm Hafsa. I'm 17 years old and I study at the Henley College. In the documentary we're doing about hidden poverty in the UK and whether there's a solution to this problem. Most people think of Henley as a wealthy place, but there's hidden aspects of poverty in South Oxfordshire. We're going to be interviewing Andrew, who teaches public services at Henley College. What's your name, age, and how long have you been a teacher? Uh, so, yeah, my name's Andrew Unsworth, 34. Uh, I've been teaching here for about eight years. 19.3 million people experience poverty for at least one year between 2010 to 13. What age children do you teach and what subjects do you teach? So yeah, they're 16 to 19 and it's public services. 4.6 million people were in persistent poverty for three of the past four years. Does the school have any systems in place to help children in poverty? Uh, yeah, I think there's quite a few systems, support systems and networks and obviously uh, finance department, quite helpful, student services, so yeah. 60% of single parent households experience poverty between 10 to 10 to 13. Do you think the school could do more? Uh, everywhere could always do more I suppose, but um, I suppose one of the issues is probably finding out who needs the help and when um, and getting the right levels of help. Um, yeah, I mean it only takes however long to get to know the students if it's not all sort of documented before and obviously Students that come to college come from what, 50 different schools or whatever. We get to know you in sort of five or six weeks or even longer. Um, it's going to take time, isn't it? So, yeah. 40% of those aged 65 and up experience poverty between 2010 to 13. Can you notice if a child is affected by poverty? Um, sometimes, yes. <laughs> um, visibly. Uh, that presents itself in a lesson. Um, it might be something that you just notice that you know, haven't got the equipment over and over again. Or um, for me, if we're trying to go on a, a, like a school trip and it involves payment, um, but sometimes it's very difficult to spot, um, particularly when it's busy and you know there's lots of lessons and things like that. So not always, no. UK ranked 13 out of the 28 EU member state for overall poverty. children in the school are affected by poverty? Not accurately, no. Probably more than I think. <laughs> Who do you think is to blame for poverty being such a big issue? Um, without getting too political, there's obviously austerity in the government and I think it's just a national, national problem. So, yeah, it's been getting worse for the last decade. I mean, they say we're out of it now, but obviously, obviously not. It's never going to be perfect, but yeah, it's um, where does the money go, I suppose is. From our research, we can see that hidden poverty has gotten worse over the years. Poverty has such a huge effect on millions of people every day. Basic necessities are needed that aren't available to a lot of people out there. If you have the chance to help, please do.